Hello guys and welcome to another Premiere Pro tutorial. This effect that we are going to create today is called a blood edge effect but with some RGB thrown in there as well. So the first thing you need to do is to create an adjustment layer so you come over to your project panel over here, click on this new item icon and click adjustment layer. Hit OK. Drag your adjustment layer on top of your video clip and stretch it to the duration of your video clip. Now move over to your first library over here and search for the VR glitch and drag the VR digital glitch onto your adjustment layer. Now move over to the effects tab and under your VR glitch, open your distortion and under your distortion, change your geometry distortion X down to zero, your distortion complexity turn it to one, your distortion rate turn it to zero. Next, manipulate your color distortion to a color that you like. And you can also change the color evolution to give you a color that you like as well. And now this is what we have. What we want to do at this point is to clear out the center so that the center is more visible. So we'll close back our distortion over here. And under this VR digital glitch, we're going to select this create ellipse mask. And we're going to drag this to the edges. We're going to set our feather at around 250 and select inverted. Now go back to the first library over here and search for the lens distortion. Drag this also onto your adjustment layer and move down in your effects control tab under your lens distortion and change your curvature to minus 15. This will distort the edges of your image. Next, you go back to your project panel and create a new adjustment layer. So I'll click on new item once more, adjustment layer, okay. And I'll drag this above my previous adjustment layer. I'll select my new adjustment layer, move back to my first library, and search for the fast blur effect. Drag the fast blur onto your newly created adjustment layer and move to your effects control tab and under your newly created adjustment layer, set blurriness to anything to you like. I think around 20 works fine for me. And I'm going to repeat edge pixel. Now to clear the center once more, I'm going to select this create ellipse mask. And once more, I'm going to drag this to the edges. and max my feather to somewhere around 250 and hit inverted and that's it guys we are done if you guys enjoyed this video kindly hit the like button and subscribe and don't forget to drop your feedbacks in the comment section thank you guys for watching this video to the end and see you in my next video tomorrow